Oh, good morning. And um, progress hobby-wise has been ra rather slow uh, recently. Uh, and I'm trying to get through these rather um, very nice scouts by Perry, but they're not the most exciting of subjects. And it's a, a limba uh, pack. So it's six horses, three riders. Uh, push these through quite quickly. So for once, I've just painted the, the uh, horses in their block colours uh, and then just left them, washed them and left them and just concentrated on the the flesh tones that once again. I've gave the equipment on the horses, the tack I think it's called, a um, bit of a highlight. As you can see there, this horse has just had a, a non-oil wash and that's it. Um, because the subject's not of huge interest, I just thought I'd push those through. Uh, likewise with the Confederate horse holders, which I've done two sets. And I made a bit of a faux pas in the video when I described, or oh, I said that one of the packs was missing a horse. It was in fact an oversight on my part that uh, one of the packs has four horses and one has three, which is reflected in the price. Uh, so more fool me really. Um, so this is the first three. Again, the horses are just flat colours because I can't see myself um, being too critical of horse holder stands. Uh, but the figures are going very nice. That's one pack. The other pack with the four horses. Um, you can tell the difference between the two packs because one has those unusual foot, um, you know, those covers for the feet or boots where the others have those metally bits, whatever they're called. Can't remember. Well, there you go, that's that. Those, um, again, all flat colours and a bit of highlighting on the equipment and the figure. That's those. What I might do is drop my limbers from six horses down to four which will give me a couple of um ho sorry, sorry horses that will pull this cart which i picked up from ken in that big swap and I'm talking about ken and that big swap um he did include um 12 sharpshooters in the uh, swap for my Normans and I've what I've done here is I've rebased them there we go I haven't touched the figures at all and I just put them onto 50 mil square bases and they will represent one of the sharpshooter units uh, Burton sharpshooters possibly um, the stats for black powder, I was thinking giving it a bit of a thought. I might just fill this as a normal regiment uh, with the sharpshooter roll, probably elite four plus, and an integral sniper. So hopefully, um, brings me up to 23 regiments there. And that was a nice easy way of doing it, I must admit. There's only 12 figures on the bases. Uh, figures possibly by Redoubt, they look very Redoubt-like to me. Um, and as usual, with the sharpshooters you get um, telescopic sights popping away at anybody important. Um, two to a base, three, two, three, two, just to give me a bit of frontage there. A bit closer. See the flesh tones could have done with a, a highlight bring them up to what, how I normally paint them, but I thought, no, I'd just push these through. Right, okay, and that's it. Um, next up, more horse holders, this time for the Union, and then it's on to the dismounted cavalry. Thanks for watching.